Okay, so let's talk a little bit about knowing when your baby's ready to sleep a little longer at nighttime. All babies are born not really knowing the difference of day and night. When they're inside the womb, they just sleep based off of whenever they want to. They can sleep day, night, whenever is comfortable for them. When they come outside of the womb, they're starting to build their circadian rhythms, which is gonna to communicate to them when it's time to sleep and when it's not time to sleep based off of the sun rising and the sun setting. So the first stage of circadian rhythms are developed with just body temperature. They're regulating their body temperature right when they're born. But the second stage is a really big aha moment. It's kind of a cool one for you to look for. So if your baby is somewhere around six to nine weeks, I look for around eight weeks old, they stop pooping at nighttime. And this is such a cool sign and such a, a realistic thing for you to see because our babies are nonverbal. Sometimes these communications are hard to understand, but this one's like a big one parents can see. So when your baby stops pooping at nighttime, they're telling you that their digestive system is actually going into more of a rest and repair time at nighttime, allowing them to get a deeper sleep at nighttime. And that's actually their second stage of development of circadian rhythm. So it's the first time that they can separate daytime from nighttime and they fully are starting to understand it by their body saying, oh, at night we sleep deeper and in the daytime we work on our food and our calories. It doesn't mean you can pull the feeds from the nighttime just yet, but it is a really cool communication for you to know your baby's finally understanding the difference of day and night and we can move into the next stage of developing and supporting their sleep as they're growing into it. So look for the no poops at nighttime. It's a really cool one. And let me know what you guys think about it. Bye.